injured, get excellent attorneys at the Pisan Chin Law Firm. That's the spirit bandit. Only it's supposed to be on the chin. Pisan Chin. Okay, went to uh, the world's largest Cabela's outfitter today. And um, I got some things for my nephew, Gabriel, and I'm getting ready to mail him home. One of the things I got was uh, this book, Antlers Forever, about uh, moose. And um, before I send it home, I wanted to read it to Bandit, who is also needs a stimulated mind and uh, could benefit from storytelling. So he's got a little stuffed moose there. And uh, we're going to read Antlers Forever. Okay, ready, Bandit? Antlers Forever, written by Francis Bloxham, illustrated by Jim Sollers. Look at him, what's he doing? What's he doing there? What's he doing? He's measuring his antlers. Look at that, that's just cute. For Big Dog and our children, and our children's children, with love. Big Dog, somebody was thinking of you, buddy. So hard to film. <laughs> I was filming the bird and I was all zoomed in and then it's like giant Kevin head right there. <laughs> that was great. Cause she like turned and looked at me like, what did you film it? <laughs> Either the bake oven knob or the next road. The next road is 19. We can do that. Mm -hmm. Rebecca, you can do it. You can do it. 19. Now you have an info. I have these donuts. Mm -hmm. You like the powdered ones too. You're calling it those. Mm -hmm. Watch out, dude, there's a rattle here. Oh, look at this guy. Yeah. Nice. Ice King. Big rattlesnake, man. Come over this way. Yeah, he's a good specimen. Yeah. I saw a tiny guy earlier. Yeah. So he's well, not earlier but further up on the trail. Right.
I'm going to record everyone now. Actually, cool. Everybody has to be recorded. I want to be in the video. Well, no one has. You can be in this video. Hi, uh, <laughs> Okay, ready, Bandit? He's crazy. He's a madman dog thing. He makes it look easy. Is that Wolfman? What? Wolfman. Wolfman. Mossy. Mossy rock. How'd you get your trail name? Oh, I slipped on a mossy rock and like. Let's see. Kind of a step formation down over here. There's a whole another thing trying to <laughs> film that. This is the knife edge, guys, I think. It has to be. It looks like a knife edge. Yeah. yeah. Come on. What are you doing? What are you doing? Ha! Ah. Gross. We are walking along the knife's edge. Yeah, that's not good. Okay. Oh, that's a nice view. some crazy squawking in the bushes over there and two birds were uh, trying to get this black snake away from their nest. I watched it eat one of their fledgling birds so I went in and after trying to deter him so someone could get a hiking pole um, he wasn't coming out so I just kind of grabbed him with my bare hands and pulled him out of the brush and here he is. Now we're going to move him away from that nest and hope that he doesn't eat any more baby birds. Don't come near me with that thing. So I checked the nest. Mom and dad are still alive in the nest and uh, two baby birds. Saved two baby birds today because I'm pretty sure the snake would have eaten them all. I'd say so. I think she's thankful to you, though. She'll probably like you. Let me see it. Yeah, I just want to see the baby birds.
Well, Kevin, you finally did it. You finally broke my continuity. Continuity? Is that, did I use that in the wrong I'm application? Sure. Yeah, I don't know it well enough. Um, well, you made me slack pack. Boom. <laughs> yeah. And did this slack packing. I'm slack packing. And, uh, but camera's going all crazy. I zoomed in like all the way. Right on your nose. Yep. But uh, we're just going what, like five miles? Is that it? And then maybe more after that. It's supposed I didn't to be the scoop. It's supposed to be like a rainy day or something. Figured I'd try it out. Seems like everyone's doing it. We're trying a little bit of a slack pack. Figured it'd be good for the dog. And, uh, yeah. Probably better to go this way. Oh, yeah. Over here. Yeah. Yeah. What? Uh, definitely. <laughs> oh, my. The puns, they're strong with this one. Did you hear Hannah? Yes. Like, not Yeti. Guys, I feel like you're on a day hike. Okay. Best way up. This way. You go that way. Gosh, monkey children, all of you. I think that entirely depends on how tall and how tall you are or how you climb. There's multiple ways up. How do I get I would come over here. Cool guys. Hold on. I have to I'm in a really bad position right now. Do you want to come back? You could almost walk behind you kind of the way that I went, go up on that big rock that's kind of reddish. And then once you get up there. There's some spots that you can dig your feet into. Okay. If you need me to, I can stick a hand out. Hey, if you want to sit down, Ron. And, um... 
It's just it's just a beetle. It's not gonna bite you or sting you. Just keep just focusing on climbing. No, just go away, Nina. Just go. I'm trying to figure out how to. Bring your foot a little closer up. There you go, there you go. So you know what, I might be, hold on, let me go over Why? here. Why does it? Why this is a better spot. Go behind you want to get pulled up? Okay. Wait, are you going to fall? No, I'm good. Okay. Yeah, get Olivia, come over here and get her other arm. No, wait, hold on, let go. You got it? Uh, okay, help me out. Wait. You're pretty much up here now. I think you got it. Cool. All right, just in line. Walking through? Yeah, like an apple tree and a peach tree. Yeah. And a peach tree. So you just walk through, grab one, and start eating it. And it would make shade. And hopefully, if they didn't have that, then there probably wouldn't be this much drop. Mm -hmm. have to go through. Yeah. Yeah, that'll probably happen in New Hampshire and Maine. Because those, those mountains are so tall that you can't really build towns on them. I like to see town when everyone's going into town. Right before. Yeah. Other than never. You're not going into town and you see town. Well, it's going to open up up here, I think. Whoa. I think we should have like peaches and apples and pears and stuff and have them all right here so Tiger can just come and pick them. Whoa. So, um, slack packing yesterday was great. It was over some of the most challenging, rocky terrain we've had to climb over. And, um, I'm glad I did it. So, last night, um, we were all put up in our hammocks. And this is me and the Orr family, and another hiker that's name is Squirrel. We all agreed that we heard some rocks 
clacking around. Just sounded like something was playing up on the rocks. It didn't sound like some someone or something was just walking. It sounded like something was smashing rocks against other rocks just to make noise. And at um, some points it was really rhythmic. It was, I guess when I heard it, I knew it was rocks, but one of the first things I thought was maybe some tree knocking. And I hear in different regions where there are rocks, Bigfoot might use them in a similar fashion. But uh, I don't know how I feel about that. I didn't say anything to the rest of the hikers. I just kind of logged that in the back of my memory. It was weird. It was super late and no hikers came through after we set up. And there was just those clacking sounds on the rocks for a few minutes. And then it started to uh, thunder and rain. And I got quiet again. And I fell asleep. Ron, are you able to hold back some grass some, so I can get the whole thing? Uh, I don't really want to. You don't want to mess with it with your pole? Yeah, I could do that. Come on, maybe. the snake fighter here. That's a big one, guys. Ooh, baby. Here, no, no, let's not. No, let's not. It's he's not one, he's though. not full rattle right now. That's just kind of a warning. That is the biggest one I've seen on the trail. He's going. It's weird. He's got a tiny head in comparison to Look the rest his of his body. Look at he's really rattling. Okay. Getting too close, guys. You might want to back up a little bit. Do they bite? Yes. Yes. I know, but I didn't know how they got the venom in you through the rattle or the. No, no the rattle's a warning. Oh. Best tarp and hiking pole tent ever, but it's shelter.
slight packing again courtesy of mutter and uh, this pack is courtesy of Kansas gonna try to get into New Jersey today I don't like it going that way. Where did it go? I can't even like... Be careful, Elena. Man, there's some big yeah, we snakes can around close, here. Though. Yeah, we can. Bandit. Bandit. Chill, buddy. Here. I think he's gonna... It can move fast. I know, I'm trying to figure out where Bandit. its head is. That's a good idea. You better tell your mom. Do you see the head? Did it go under the rock? It went under the rock. Yeah. Still can't find its body here. Maybe you're like close to this guy. Yeah, I could. Let me see. Be careful. Oh, he's under there. I still don't see him. Oh, he might oh, be I see up. him. You do? Yeah. Look, Brian, over here. Whoa! See? Yeah, I do. He's looking at us. He's looking, and I can get his body in there. Okay, man. I'm going to be the snake hunter here. What is it? It's a huge snake. It's bigger than yesterday. A yep. yep. Bandit. Oh, I think it is bigger than yesterday. About the same, maybe. Can I see it? I want to see it. No. It's ready to strike, man. Well, no I don't know if I can get a picture of it. It's down there. Laura, can you give it extra? Mm -hmm. So, we have, recently we have Baby wife was here. Bass was here recently. Pockets. When was your bass? The 18th. When today's the 20th.